Hello and welcome to the Rugged Rock Hound. Today, some more rock cutting. Let's get at it. Starting off with a piece of petrified wood that broke on the other side. Not too bad. Next up, some red horn coral. Ooh, nice. Too bad it didn't go all the way up into there. But yeah, we got some red down here. Of course, it would have also looked nice going across that way. Next up, another limonite cube that doesn't look so, didn't look so good from the outside. Oh, nice, we got some pirate in that one. Very good. Another cube, big one. Let's see. Oh, not much in that one. Still cool. Next up, a little bit of agate. Broke a little bit. And there's what we got. Interesting. Next up, an agate that I found down near the town of Enterprise, Utah. Okay. Hey, that red. If you could get some of that red in the back, that could look pretty nice. Okay, next up, something that looked beautiful from the outside is agate. Unfortunately, I do not remember where this came from. Whoa! Oh, that's cool. Look at all those circles, colors, patterns. That is neat stuff. This is one of those bird's eye seashells. One side of it broke, and this side, really nice. Look at that one. It's beautiful. Another bird's eye gastropod. Once again, one side broke. Not too bad, though. So now we have here a small little geode from Dugway. Whoa! Look at all that red. You don't usually get a lot of red like that in these. This is actually more of a thunder egg a little bit, huh? Because the agate filled it in up there. Here is another geode from Dugway. Oh, that's pretty nice. That's a very interesting pocket. I like how you can see where the uh, water worked its way in with the agate quartz. Chalcedony. All of the above. It's all silicon dioxide. Here we have a nice double Dugway geode. Ooh, that looks very nice. Look at the inside of that. Got some nice crystals growing through it. Here we've got another Dugway geode. Oh, yeah, this one's more of a thunder egg. Look at all that agate going through it. All the cool stuff there. Really nice. So here we have another Dugway geode. The other side of it fractured, so I'll just kind of show you some of the pieces. Some nice pieces. Some quartz crystals on them. And I really liked this piece. Look at that one. And then here's the side that didn't fracture. Look at that. It's a beautiful one. Such a cool pocket in there, and I like how it got how it cut. So here we have a nice piece of petrified wood. Whoa, it's much darker inside, like wood color, rather than that white outside. That's pretty cool. That's a nice piece. Here's some kind of a weird agate or something. Oh, well, that's interesting. Some very interesting textures going through there. So here's a rock from an old copper mine with some malachite, teeny bit of azurite. Hey, look at all that azurite in there. That's pretty cool. So here's some uh, petrified wood from uh, Nevada. Hey, look at that. That's pretty cool. Yeah, some neat patterns in there. So here's some of that Nevada pinker wood. Whoa, it's very dark inside actually. Huh. Much darker. And here's the last one for today. Another piece of petrified wood. Ooh, oh, look at that. Oh, that's a nice piece. Look at those colors, patterns. That is a good piece. Oh, what a good one to end on. And that's all for today's cutting video. Some really nice stuff. I hope you enjoyed it. And remember, there's treasure everywhere.